Well, I think Louisville has figured out how to put in a bike pedestrian pathway at a standard I have not seen anywhere else. So we're on the second ride of the day. We've made our way over to Louisville, Kentucky, and we're currently on the Louisville Loop, which I guess, according to what I've been reading, eventually is a trail system that's supposed to circumnavigate the city of Louisville, which is quite a task because it's a pretty spread out large city. So we're just over on the east side right now. Doing a second ride of the day, getting a few more miles in. But so far this trail has offered us everything from what seems like about a 20 foot wide concrete path to now we're on a more traditional paved trail. It's definitely not flat. So it'll be a little bit of fun reversing our direction because right now we're dropping down into something. Well, we find ourselves in Kentucky still. Second trail of this journey in the state of, of Kentucky. We're on the, down the Dawkins Line Rail Trail, which I guess way back in the Civil War days, this was kind of the site of a little skirmish between some Union troops and some Confederate cavalry. And sounds like the Confederate cavalry lost that battle. And then the General in charge had another battle back at what's called Middle Creek. Apparently he won that one too, and then he returned to Virginia. So we're gonna go see what the Dawkins line's about. It's Kentucky's longest rail trail. So we're not sure what that means yet. I don't know if we'll go the entire way, but we'll, we'll give it a solid go. We're almost ready here. The trikes are mostly packed. The old people are kind of moving, so we'll go see what this means today. Well, we're in the land of Kentucky, which is kind of a interesting mixture of a little bit of everything we've seen so far. We're riding down this trail, you're seeing pretty modern houses with brand new cars. Then you come around the next corner and you're, you're seeing kind of the opposite spectrum of everything. I guess this thin little 
ribbon of old rail lane kind of lets you do that as we kind of proceed down this trail. Well, we're back in the parking lot where we parked the cars several hours ago. So we did the Dawkins Line Trail from the Jenny Creek Trailhead up and over through the tunnel down to a little town of Royalton where there's a Dollar General store of all things or a dollar store or whatever they call it. But enjoyable ride. I think the trail's in good condition. We did run into one local that was talking about they're going to pave it sometime in the next two months and four wheelers and side by sides. And I don't know. I don't think this is one to pave. I think it would take away some of the essence of what you're doing. But we enjoyed our ride, second ride here in Kentucky. So still State 38. Hopefully, we'll get a few more done before this fall trip wraps up so we'll see you again somewhere in Kentucky right about now well we're on our third ride here in the state of Kentucky we are at what's called the Prestonburg Passage and we've got somebody who joined us today that's the cousin Meg down from Cincinnati so we'll go see what Prestonburg Kentucky is like we do have the <coughs> ominous sign the black about Urus Americanus commonly known as the black bear but they got a sign up so maybe today I'll get a video of a black bear unlike that one we didn't quite catch the other day so we're gonna get going at the paved path about nine miles one direction, so probably a quick little ride for today. This is quite the path. It is a rail trail, but it's a paved one, which has a flavor all on its own. A lot faster to ride, a lot smoother. This is just a delightful way to start the day. Well, that's not something you see every day. I guess that's one of the little treats along the trail. We made it as far as Owensboro, Kentucky today, which sits up on the river. Indiana's on the other side. And opened the app, looked, and lo and behold, about a quarter of a mile from our hotel is the Atkinson Greenway here in Owensboro. So we decided an evening ride was in order. The sun has come up, the weather is nice, 
and we found a nice little greenway. Bikeway, walkway, joggerway, strollerway, hang out on the side of the pondway here in Owenboro. So it was it was kind of nice. This is a very pleasant ride. We're in the middle of the trail, so we decided we would go east tonight, and then tomorrow morning we might finish the trail out then, but this is what it looks like. And the only thing I could say so far is on the one end there were some root push-ups under the trail, which made a few bounces. But to this city's credit, you can actually see they brought along a paving grinding machine and attempted to smooth those out. Alaska could learn from that. So, very nice ride. We're going to continue back to the hotel. And I guess we'll maybe do another Kentucky ride tomorrow.